Ahmed's actually gone to collect my sisters and my dad, I think. I think we're very close to iftar. Yeah, we're like about 30 minutes to iftar. But you know, I'm just going to stick these in the oven. Well, they cook really fast all at once. I just brush them up on. Well, that's what I usually do. Because, you know, they're like, like, they'd be nice, yeah, for an oil and stuff. But uh, they'd be crispy the way I stick them in the oven as well. And they're healthier, so. I made a cake, but I made double ingredients. So I, I don't know, I just thought it'd be all right. Put it in the oven. For its time, took it out, let it cool down while I got ready. Come back down to poke the holes in to figure out the middle was wrong. Wow. So I had to put it back in the oven for another 20 minutes. And now I have no time to let it cool down. No one's credit for this cake. <laughs> No credit, but Zahra made it. So my dad made it. <laughs> and then when everyone thinks I'm like, mm, I said, I made it. My brothers are animals. They're monsters. But that cake right there is going to get mashed 100% regardless of how it tastes. What are you doing, Louisa? Pick that up, pick it up. It's way too hot. Oh, whoa. No, no, it's grand. It's grand. Look, it's actually grand. I'm literally wrong for that. My family's going to come over to Ahmed's family house today. For iftar and shot more. You know what I hate? When the packets aren't open and you haven't separated them yet. It's like long having to separate each one of them. I should probably get my sister to come over and just start separating the whole thing. It's literally like it's long having to separate and then also do it. Yeah. Keep it moving. And there you go. Ramadan spam was actually lion. They are even on. I forget what day we're actually on of like fasting, but it's like lion. Oops. My mum whips off dinner in the space of like five minutes. That was in five, ten minutes. We're about thirty minutes away. <laughs> Let me rub it. Smay, look at this cake I cooked, bro. So, Allah, you cooked that. So, Allah, Allah. Allah. <laughs> bro, why would they have about a cake, man? <laughs> what are you saying, yeah? Is that they'll break my wife, mate? Mate, you just missed the fat. Oh, the, the rest is for Caesar, isn't it? Mm -hmm. yeah, get some meat. Meat? Yeah, go and get some meat for Mama. Mama, I'll give you Mama. Oh, I'll give you Oh, I'm a genius right here. None of these. Eat loud. Eat loud. Bougie. You're allowed to be bougie because you're a princess. If I was bougie, I wouldn't drink it at all. The real reason you don't drink it? There's so many things in top water. Yeah, you'd rather drink out of a river than drink because they actually put Diploid fluoride which is not healthy for you and there's like a load of metals and all that kind of stuff in your water bottled water also has like uh, nanoparticles of plastic but the best water to drink out of would be clay because like just minerals and, and the clay. best water to ever drink is you violent individual you just killed the spider when you could have just kicked him out she mushed him on the wall look there he's there he says, I think we're going Belfast. I think we're going Belfast as well. We're, the bus, we're, going Belfast. we're like undecisive of what exactly where we were going, so I think we actually are going Belfast. We are going to England. Don't see the Queen. <laughs> Don't need your passport to go to Belfast. Drop it there. Just past Manchester. Drop it there. There's my mom. Say hello, mom. Hello. Who are you talking to? The fuck? Oh, hello. You better be out of hospital for eight. Shalom. Shalom. Your kids want your home. Bring I'm here filling up diesel. Guess how much they're charging? A Two year. euro. And 50% of that is tax. Anyone who drives knows this pain. Where's Mr. Stress? <laughs> we just got to the UK. Only English ready. I have no internet. Louisa has no internet. So we're just gonna have to sit here and actually talk to each other. You know it's gas. Every single nasheed, I only know the, like the first two sentences of it. And then Khalas is finished. Look. <laughs> So we just got here like six minutes away. Like just that house over there looks like England. 680 pounds for parking, what a rip. And you have Ahmed over here praying in it. And we made it. I was Googling and I said that this is um, an outlet, but it looks like a bougie shopping center. It just looks like a shopping center. So we drove all the way here to go to a shopping center. Dyson Airwrap. This is what Louisa wants right here. And there's no one in the shop right now, so we can actually rub it. Oh, I love it. That's it, listen, that's getting robbed. <laughs> I just came up with a genius plan of how we're gonna get Louisa at Dyson because it's sold out everywhere. I've already tried to get it from everywhere. I'm gonna need you guys to go on to Dyson Ireland and just spam them to get Louisa at Dyson era because people have been spamming me in the comments and they don't know that I've been trying, man. Man's been out here trying to get Louisa at Dyson era, but it's very hard to get. So the best. We just go straight to the source. So we're gonna go spam Dyson Ireland and tell them, listen, sponsor a hijabi. I was also deep in it, man. Like there's literally no representation from Muslim, like from Muslims, like with like hair care products. Obviously you don't have to show the hair. Sponsor a few Muslims, you know what I mean? Uh, what, do, do they think Muslim, all Muslim women are bald? My wife's bald, but no, they're not actually bald. Anyways, yeah, so I'm gonna need all you guys to go on to Dyson Ireland, spam them, tag Louisa and say, sponsor her, sponsor a hijabi, tag Louisa. And then 
then if that doesn't work, then we're going to go on to Dyson's main page because Dyson Ireland, I have I thought this out, man. I have a plan. Dyson Ireland is actually a lot smaller page. So we'll probably be able to reach out to them easier. If that doesn't work, then we're going to go push for the big page, the 500k page. I believe that you will get Louisa. And we need to aid, guys, yeah? So this, you need to spam today. There's people spamming me, but they don't understand. It's not in my hands. It is not in my hand. It's sold out everywhere. Is that a combo drop? Defo drop. Oh, I've got an extra ledge. It look cheap. Yeah, it just doesn't sit nicely here. Oh, I actually think it's fresh. It really? Yeah. Yeah, much better. Better than the, the, the other ones? Yeah. Is that on my face? You can see your full body. This is me, Ahmed. <laughs> Get <laughs> out here, bro. We're collecting, man. We collect out here. You either get used or you're useless. You're holding the bag. He's mean as you. <laughs> That's not very nice, actually. This guy is standing there in his socks, walking around this shopping center like it's his house. Are you okay? You know what's funny? Oh. I lost my phone and everything. <laughs> yeah, you think I'm you're at home. You actually, that's actually a fresh outfit. Shout out, he's been My dad used to wear shirts like this. I don't know if anyone else's dad used to do and it. We used to rob them guys and wear them. Yeah, when we were younger. <laughs> yeah, he's spoiling us. 25p for a carrier bag. It's mad if we get them for free in Ireland. Robbery. Thank you. I came out thinking that I won't get nothing today, yeah? But it seems like I have the bulk of the clothes right now. Man's here hustling. <laughs> hint, hint, nudge, nudge. Yeah, you know. I think I got the hint though. Look at what there is because obviously we're fasting and then 8 o'clock we don't come and then we're disappointed that there's not enough halal food here. So we're in this restaurant just to see if how much halal food they have. We don't know whether to eat here or not because we don't really know what's halal and what's not halal. And I haven't seen any workers around, but the food does look banging or that maybe I'm just starving. That's the issue. Okay, halal. halal. Okay. This is no halal. No halal. You know what I mean? And this is halal. Oh, ha, ha, ha. You cut like this, though. She said this is halal. Good few things are halal. So where are we eating? And there's loads of sides and stuff like that. It smells nice. Loads of desserts too, and a chocolate fountain, guys. We are in the cinema just to kill time. Because he's mean, I want to kill time. Yeah. yeah. But if we went into Fantastic Beasts now, are we running out of time? Or is it still the ads? It's still the ads. Lovely. Do you want to hear the good news or the bad news? The good news is the movie finishes. The bad news is about 20 past What we can do is get jelly into the movie. Make it fast. With jelly, oh my God. <laughs> no, we can bring water. And then if the movie's not that great, it's dip, yeah. Yeah. Yasmina spontaneously just told us. Yeah, I'm bringing you out, guys, out, and I'm going to shop for you. And then she talked to us to Belfast. Yeah. She keeps giving out to me because, like, I couldn't find things, and she keeps kept telling me to buy things. Yeah, the movie's starting. Mr. Camel Man. The cinema without eating doesn't feel right. Like, the only reason I ever come to cinema is to eat. Yeah. I haven't even yet. That was literally the deadest movie of my life. Oh my god. Literally, literally the last minute we don't know what happens in the end. Rate the movie. No, I'm only joking. It's actually about four, four or five. But would you pay for it? I mean, I did. <laughs> Are you ready for a buffet? Yeah, I'm gonna go over to the pizza section first. So let's go eat this. What is this uh, selection? Like? Call the chaleta. I call it a chaleta. I'm gonna this first and then I'll go back and have the Chinese. Try to start the walk. Yeah. The sunna, if you don't have dates, is that water. Pizza's nice. The hash brown's nice. The onion is nice. He's made us still eating. Louisa already mashed her food. I mashed my food. You ready for round two? Thank you. Why are you trying this time? My two personal cows. Round number two. I'm finished and I'm still waiting for these to eat. Man. Slow eaters. I'm ready to go for a third round. I just want a little bit of the sauce. That's it. This time we literally just got the smallest thing ever. Cause don't know what it's like or anything. And we just had two plates of food already. Got some naan and some tikka masala. I was going to dip it in it. I was trying to walk out of the toilet and there's one of them wet signs. And I tried to walk over it and we kicked the whole thing. Oh my god. They came in fully confident, two of them. <laughs> Cheesecake. The mess you are making. Dessert, dessert, dessert. You know when you like come in and you think you're going to eat the whole place, then you're just full after two plates. Like, to be honest, I didn't have three plates, I had two plates and the last six is like some naan bread and sauce. <laughs> the Chinese was actually nice. Pizza was average. Pasta was alright as well. And the desserts weren't it. Stuffed. It was alright. Yeah, like... Not in, not in special. It wasn't a wall, but it was like, alhamdulillah. Yeah, alhamdulillah. It was like average. <laughs> Let's see the violation. 22 pounds. 11 pounds for like hours. But still, actually, that was going to be 22 pounds. We kind of did scam yeah. the system. <laughs> we didn't. Oh, yeah. And he insults me through my mother and the message of Allah. He didn't say, oh, Abu Dhar, the man. Thank you guys for watching. We just got home and it's like two half two. I'm going to see you on the next one.